Hey, hey, hey. How is everybody doing? We, we're going to do a very uh, late night slash early morning insomnia stream because I uh, was on the podcast last night on the goddamn podcast, which I'll grab the link for, by the way, for you as well, if you didn't see that. Um, and someone said that Rev had went live. So I didn't get a chance to see it until after the um, podcast, and I only watched, like, maybe a second or two, and I was like, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and go on and cover this. This seems like it's important enough that I should go on, and so that's what I'm going to do. Um, this has thankfully been uploaded to YouTube, so we don't have to watch it on Instagram, thanks to uh, Even Irrelevancy which I'm going to drop the link in the chat for you guys. Um, but it looks like Rev and Shani had to call the cops on G-Man. It's hard to hear me. Okay, hold on. Let me turn. It's it's hard to hear me still. I've got it turned way up. I don't want to blast anybody out or anything. Um but hopefully it's working okay. All right. So let's just jump right into this and see what the hell is going on. Hi, guys. What's up? I am not going to wait for people to come in. I just want a statement to be made. Okay. Official. Because this is, as you see, it's the real Rev and Shanny channel. So when you want to hear actual statements from pe from us... Because we happen to be two people that have like 50 million search, people searching, 50 million on TikTok. So if you want to know the deal, you come here. WPW? I don't know what that is. Sorry. Hi, Gucci Trolls. I want this stated. Everything, and I'll include Shani in this. Yeah, God bless you, Neocat Goddess. You're kind, okay? Hi, Amy. What's up? Oh, my God. Just I just want to say this, okay, and make it clear that the reason that you... Yeah, I'm live now. Hi. <laughs> the reason that I did everything I did with Mr. Gary Lamont Moore, also known as G-Man on YouTube. Yeah. The reason that we did any of the shit we did was in the name of Jesus Christ. I want this known. It wasn't for me getting some kind of, oh, I gave a house to a black man. What's oh up, Ling and things? Here we go. What's up, Andre? Y'all deserve peace. Thank you, Andre. God, God bless you. I, we, I am on say I, we. Because she's my, Shani's my wife, and she owns everything that I have jointly. Always did. As of March 7th of 2018, she owned half of everything I got. All right? Which God is bless nothing. you, Andre. You have nothing. So. We heard that a brother. This is, this is what you have. Hey, what's up, Michelle? Are we really okay. going to go through this story again from the beginning? <laughs> we know what went down with you and G-Man. Why are we talking about it again and again and again? Dude, we're tired of hearing this story. I am so fuck from both sides. I am so fucking tired of hearing what went down with G-Man over and over and over again. We all know what went down. Like, y'all... <laughs> It's time to move on. Thank you. That's flattering. Okay. We viewed that man as a brother. We loved him greatly. Correct me if I'm wrong. Weren't you uh, losing the house anyway? No, absolutely not. I had plenty of money to pay it off. Uh, did G-Man ever bring the things you wanted? No. No, I told him there's no reason to contact me. I wanted no contact. You, thank you for bringing that up. Uh, eighty six. I'll call you eighty six. I can keep going. Uh, I told him put it on the front porch. You get your buddy, 
load up the truck, car, whatever he got, because he's got a friend that's got a car, load it up with the stuff I mentioned, and we're good, man. That's not his responsibility. If you want your stuff, you need to get you need to get in the car and you need to get over there and pick it up. It is not on G Man to deliver you your shit. So that's no. If you wanted your stuff, you should have went and got it. Okay, go with God. Bless you. It was just a way to show me that you appreciated the fact that I sold you a house for a dollar. Katana, what's up? I sold you a house for a fucking dollar, G man. And you sold it for $160,000. I am not a fucking, oh, gimme, gimme, gimme person. What's up, Chubbyusa? What's up, Lynn? What's, uh, G man is a creeper. What? I have to agree. Okay. That's why I call the cops. Look, I got a message yesterday from someone named uh, Devin LaRoe. And he said, dude, I just want to give you a heads up that this guy's planning on coming to your house and doing something. Now what? He wants to find out about my new fancy car. My ride, whatever I may have right now, is nobody's business but my own. Oh, so this is a thing. I didn't know. Do they, so he has a, a different vehicle than he used to have. He doesn't have the Durango, obviously, anymore. Um and then what was the other thing? A caddy? An older Cadillac? And what? So now Rev and Shanny have a different vehicle? I don't know. And honestly, I don't want... Or, and I don't know why it really matters. But Anybody knowing what I drive, because I'm going to be targeted. Because it's happened before. People will t take the air out of my tires. They'll do some weird shit. I've had vandalism on the car already. And I think it was G-Man. What? There was a board. They they stuck it through one of the pieces on the on the the spoiler on the bottom. There was. You a... think that G Man came and damaged your property? Do you really believe that? I don't. I'm not saying you should like G Man or be friendly with him at all. But do you really think he has damaged your property? Come on. And I think it was G-Man. There was a board. They they stuck it through one of the pieces on the on the the spoiler on the bottom. There was a board put through it. That's like a stalker. Gucci trolls. Yes. <laughs> you seem very forceful now. I like it. I have to be, though. I have to be. I don't want to be. Honest question, why do you keep bringing up a man if you want him to leave you alone? This is to be, have things on record. I'm not going to have things out there because I see comments. Get yourself a cheap cam and put outside. Yeah, I agree with that. He should give you whatever belongings are you, you in the house. Thank you. My gosh. Thank you, Michelle. That's all I ask. G-Man's a POS. Katana, I'm going to have to say, yeah. And stalker vibes, absolutely. Carrie demonetized channel. I still love that. He admitted he was going to creep around the house and record a video. Carrie demonetized channel. I still love that. Well, I still love the fact that you don't have a channel at all. So <laughs> I guess we all find certain things funny. Oh, that's so creepy. He was going to creep around the house and make a video. That is stalker behavior and get arrested. You can't pull that shit in this place. There's no black people here. I'm not being racist. In Scranton, plenty. But where I'm at, there's none. It's foreign. Okay? I, it's just the way it is here. You, you're kind of scared, New Rev. Well, it. I got to do what I got to do for my family. And he's, I think he's, yeah, G-Man's a fake Christian. I would never put that label, but his behavior is nuts. Wow. Yes, it would be the best to have proof of something happened. Yeah, it, that's why I preemptively called the cops. I think I made the right decision by preemptively calling the cops. I said who I was. They said, oh, yeah, your wife was pretty big on YouTube. And I was like, yep, that's what? correct. That's no, how they, easy they the not. cops said that to 
that's amazing. No, they that's did how not. That's how Shannon's known. She was pretty big on YouTube. Yeah, that's correct. Thing is, he's not of Christ. If he's done you guys wrong, he judges people too. Yeah, he judges constantly. I you got some edibles left alone, and I'm tired of hearing these names over and over and over again. I know. World War Three starting, and we got this. I know, right? Oh. You absolutely did the right God, thing. I think can't I did. People get along. I mean, hop one team, ooch, some cheap cams, put them up. Yeah, you're right. Rev, we're here for you. Tough boy Jason is getting revenge. I don't need revenge. I want the guy to leave me the fuck alone. But I want it known that I did this. Everything we did was in the name of Jesus. I put this at the altar of Jesus Christ. I, I feel, When you help someone in need, G-Man was homeless at this time. Homeless. We heard that call and said, holy shit, we got a house in Pennsylvania. Go live in it. And he ended up getting it for a dollar. And that's how he treats us. I don't care. This is just decency. I Just remo remove the Christian end of it. It's two people that literally provided a place for him to live forever if he wanted. He chose to sell it. That's fine. It's his house. But the way that we've been treated, he's not a Christian. Peace and Maranatha. Why did he name it? Jason and Shani called the cops on G-Man. I'm going to change. Let me change the name of the stream really quick because he really didn't say that. So I don't want to be clickbaiting people with the title. Hold on. Uh, instead, I'm going to put it as something else. All right. We'll do it like that. My bad, guys, to anybody that I that came in like that. I hadn't seen the whole thing, so when I saw that the name of this was Shani and Jason called the cops on G-Man, I assumed that was that that's what they did in it because that's what why the name was that. So apparently they didn't say that. Um, he said preemptively called the cops. He did say that. Was that the beginning at the very beginning when he said it? Here, I'm going to start it from the beginning again really quick. It's not long, so there's no, it's not a big deal. Hi, guys. What's up? I am not going to wait for people to come in. I just want a statement to be made. Okay, official, because this is, as you see, it's the real Rev and Shanny channel. So when you want to hear actual statements from pe from us, because we happen to be two people that have like 50 million search, people searching, 50 million on TikTok. So if you want to know the deal, you come here. Mm -hmm. WPW. What's the deal? I don't know what that is. Sorry. Hi, Gucci trolls. I want this stated. I want this stated. Everything, and I'll include Shani in this. Yeah, God bless you, Neocat Goddess. You're kind, okay? Hi, Amy. What's up? I just want to say this, okay, and make it clear that the reason that you, yeah, I'm live now. Hi. <laughs> the reason that I did everything I did with Mr. Gary Lamont Moore, also known as G-Man on YouTube, the reason that we did any of the shit we did was in the name of Jesus Christ. I want this known. It wasn't for me getting some kind of, oh, I gave a house to a black man. What's up, Bling and Things? What's up, Andre? Y'all deserve peace. Thank you, Andre. God, God bless you. I, we, I want to say I, we, because she's my, Shani's my wife, and she owns everything that I have jointly. Mm -hmm. Always did. At, as of March 7th of 2018, she owned half of everything I got. Okay, well, that's All nothing. Right? You have you, you own Andre. nothing anymore, so big deal. Get to the point. We heard we that heard. a brother. This is, this is what you have. Hey, what's up, Michelle? Okay. <laughs> Thank you. 
that's flattering. Okay. We viewed that man as a brother. We loved him greatly. Correct me if I'm wrong. Weren't you uh, losing the house anyway? No, absolutely not. I had plenty of money to pay it off. Uh, did G-Man ever bring the things you wanted? No. No, I told him there's no reason to contact me. I wanted no contact. You, th thank you for bringing that up. Uh, eighty six. Yeah, no, don't contact me. But I want you to come and bring all my stuff to me and deliver it to me because that's the way shit works. Why is that his responsibility, Rev? Like that's not his responsibility to bring you your shit. If you want your shit, you're supposed to go over there and get it. Period. I'll call you 86. I can keep my... uh, I told him, put it on the front porch. You get your buddy, load up the truck, car, whatever he got, because he's got a friend that's got a car. Load it up with the stuff I mentioned, and we're good, man. Okay, go with God. Bless you. It was just a way to show me that you appreciated the fact that I sold you a house for a dollar. Katana, what's up? I sold you a house for a fucking dollar, G-Man. And you sold it for $160,000. I am not a fucking, oh, gimme, gimme, gimme person. What's up, Chubby Usa? What's up, Lynn? What's, uh, G-Man is a creeper. What, I have to agree, okay? That's why I call the cops. Look, I got a message yesterday from someone named uh, Devin LaRoe. And he said, dude, I just want to give you a heads up that this guy's planning on coming to your house and doing something. Okay. He wants to find out about my new fancy car. My ride, whatever I may have right now, is nobody's business but my own. And honestly, I don't want anybody knowing what I drive because I'm going to be targeted because it's happened before. People will t take the air out of my tires They'll do some weird shit. I've had vandalism on the car already. And I think it was G-Man. There was a board. They they stuck it through one of the pieces on the on the the spoiler on the bottom. There was a board put through it. That's like a stalker. Gucci trolls. Yes. It's like a stalker. You seem very forceful. Now I like it. I have to be, though. I have to be. I don't want to be. Honest question, why do you keep bringing up a man if you want him to leave you alone? This is to be, have things on record. I'm not going to have things out there because I see comments. Get yourself a cheap cam and put outside. Yeah, I agree with that. He should give you whatever belongings are you, you in the house. Thank you. My gosh. Thank you, Michelle. That's all I ask. G-Man's a POS. Katana, I'm going to have to say, yeah. And stalker vibes, absolutely. Carrie demonetized channel. I still love that. He admitted he was going to creep around the house and record a video. Oh, that's so creepy. He was going to creep around the house and make a video. That is stalker behavior and get arrested. You can't pull that shit in this place. There's no black people here. I'm not being racist. In Scranton, plenty. But where I'm at, there's none. It's foreign. Okay, I, it's just the way it is here. You, you're kind of scared, new rev. Well, it I got to do what I got to do for my family. And he's, I think he's, yeah, G-Man's a fake Christian. I would never put that label, but his behavior is nuts. Yes, it would be the best to have proof of something happened. Yeah, it, that's why I preemptively called the cops. That is, so he says, that's why I pre preemptively called the cops, right? He said called the cops. So he is saying that he did call the cops. Let me go back. For my family, and he's, I think he's, yeah, G-Man's a fake Christian. I would never put that label, but his behavior is nuts. Yes, it would be the best to have proof of something happened. Yeah, it, that's why I preemptively called the cops. I think I made the right decision by preemptively calling the cops. 
I said who I was. They said, oh, yeah, your wife was pretty big on YouTube. And I was like, yep, that's correct. That's how he said, the cops said that. To, that's amazing. That's how Shani's known. She was pretty big on YouTube. Yeah, that's correct. Thing is, he's not of Christ. If Do y'all believe, though? Do you believe that? That they said that? That they were like, oh, yeah, Shani, she's a big YouTuber. I don't know. That sounds pretty far-fetched to me. I think I made the right decision by preemptively calling the cops. I said who I was. They said, oh, yeah, your wife was pretty big on YouTube. And I was like, yep, that's correct. That's how he said, the cops said that. To, that's amazing. That's how Shani's known. She was pretty big on YouTube. Yeah, that's correct. Thing is, he's not of Christ. If he's done you guys wrong, he judges people too. Yeah, he judges constantly. I you got some edibles left alone and I'm tired of hearing these names over and over and over again. I know Wait. world war three oh. starting and we got this. Oh, I know. Shit. Right. Oh, you absolutely did the right God, thing. I think I did. People get along. Why can't we all, I mean, hop along? one team, mooch, some cheap cams, put them up. Yeah, you're right. Rev. We're here for you. Tough boy. Jason is getting revenge. I don't need revenge. I want the guy to leave me the fuck alone, but I want it known that I did this. Everything we did was in the name of Jesus. I put this at the altar of Jesus Christ. I, I feel when you help someone in need, G man was homeless at this time. Homeless. We heard that call and said, Holy shit. We got a house in Pennsylvania. Go live in it. And he ended up getting it for a dollar. And that's how he treats us. I don't care. This is just decency. I just remove remove the Christian end of it. It's two people that literally provided a place for him to live forever if he wanted. He chose to sell it. That's fine. It's his house. But the way that we've been treated, he's not a Christian. Peace to Maranatha. God. What a weirdo he is. Um, all right. Well, this is not going to be a very long stream, but I did see that uh, Nick Bravo has a new stream, I think, as well. Let me let me see. Maybe. Is this the one that I think he took it all down actually, so um, that might mean that uh yeah, I think he took it down. He must not um have liked whatever he had to say in it. Oh well. That's, uh, I think then, I can't think of anything else I want to watch right now, to be honest with you. So, I think I'm just going to call it a night. It's been kind of a boring day, which is fine. That happens. Um, but yeah, I think I'm going to use it to go get some extra rest. And then, I think tomorrow night, well, aka tonight, um... I'll be doing a stream with Omni. I think Omni is going to be coming on. So you got that to look forward to. And let me grab the link really quick. Just in case any of you didn't see the podcast tonight. Just a little while ago. Um, we did. Let me grab the link. So you can go check that out if you didn't see it. Um, and that's in the chat right now. I just dropped the link. So definitely go and watch that. Subscribe. And um, I will be seeing you guys on the next one. Love you guys. Good night, everybody.